it's my second time at Travertine Hot Springs, but there's a lot of children in the main area, so there's one other hot spring over here that I think I'm going to soak in. There's a guy sitting there, but anyways. getting in this little hot spring right here. It's hot. I'm not sure what the temperature is. Maybe like 105? That's nice though. These, oh, 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 where are we? Uh, these hot springs are crowded. I thought school was back. I guess not, because there's so many children here. Like, I think there's more children than adults here. So, yeah, I did have a hot spring to myself for like 30 seconds, and a van with a family showed up and all the kids, and they're just so loud and. But I'm trying not to let that ruin the experience because I think that children need to enjoy nature too. So I think it's pretty neat that they get to experience all these places. So anyways, little rant over. Definitely crowded here. It's a Wednesday and it's about 11 o'clock in the morning. So it is crowded. I do want to come back here and maybe camp nearby and then be here in the early morning. So I might have to do a redo video and ha try to have this place to myself. The plan was to have it to myself and arrive early in the morning several times but unfortunately I just didn't get up early enough I was staying in Bridgeport so anyways let's uh hit the road made myself soak there at least. I've been here two times before and I didn't soak because there were so many people. So 
I'm trying to make myself enjoy things even when there's people around, even if it's just for five minutes, you know, just to experience it. But boy, choose a crowd in, in these hot springs. I feel like I just want the whole place to myself and I think everybody feels that way. And I'm not really into the party scene at the hot springs. I don't like a lot of noise. I like it to be quiet and I like to hear nature and all of that. I mean, there are some hot springs that are good for that, but for the most part, I like to just enjoy the peace and quiet and just let my body soak and heal. Definitely going to have to come back and make it a early morning soak. So I couldn't make much of a video at the hot springs because I had it to myself for a minute and then this guy showed up and so obviously I didn't really get to film a lot so I got out and when I got out he got out and then when after he got out I went back in and he went back in and I'm just like I can't <laughs> I can't do that and you know he was a little off I'm not gonna lie but and I try not to judge people you know a lot of people who have certain things going on they like to get out in nature where they're not judged and all that so Say hi, Brucey. Yeah, so anyways, Bruce stayed in the car this time. I, I do let Bruce go sometimes when we're at the hot springs, but normally only if we're alone. And if the water's not too hot, that's usually when I'll let him go. But this time there's so many people and there were a lot of dogs off-leash dogs just running through the water and stuff and yeah anyways this was a good this is a good hot spring I definitely am wanting to try it early morning I keep saying that but winter's coming here I woke up this morning it was 19 degrees so I'm not sure how this road would be in the snow it's not that long. I don't know. I don't know what the snow situation is up here. I bet it's pretty heavy. There's a lot of winter sports up here too. So. This is just me rambling. So you cannot camp past the sign here. But you can camp before the sign. And there's a lot of primitive spots. There's a little road right here. So you can camp nearby. When I came last time, this whole place was filled with people. And it's mainly because this is the Toyabi Forest. And last time, California had, last time I was here, California had closed all of their forests except for this one. So it kind of makes sense that this one was crowded. Uh, this area was crowded. I camped nearby pretty close up the road here and there wasn't really any people but yeah time to get away into some solitude all right well this is where i'm gonna end this video i hope you enjoyed it i know it's short and sweet and uh hope you take my advice if you decide to come visit these hot springs i'll see you guys in the next video bye